So Jason Lee has come forward to absolutely drag Cassie. And I think that his comments are not only extremely insensitive, but extremely ignorant. But not surprised. Hey guys, it's Marad Morali. Hopefully you guys are doing well today. Back in again with another video. If you have not subscribed, guys, click that button for daily and consistent content. Subscribe. Send a super thanks. I would appreciate it. There's a dollar sign if you guys wish to. Click that button and subscribe and let's get into this video. Now where there is mess, there is Jason Lee. Whenever it's clean up on aisle three, you'll find Jason Lee. So I feel like I'm not surprised by this man and what he's come to say, but his tweets are quite outrageous, really. And he said, Cassie claimed our word yesterday, settled and thanked her fans and attorneys for their support. What the F? She's going to get dragged for filth. A lot of men are coming out with this and I don't understand why. Cancer culture, social media are a disaster. Did he do it or not? Was all that for a money grab or not? Y'all can't tell me what you think. I am puzzled. Is Mercury in retrograde? So, of course, he's come out to immediately defend PDD. And I feel like he was doing this with a mega situation as well when it went down with Tory, where Jason has come to say all this. Now, granted, his show, which does well, and I'm happy that his show does well, is on Revolt TV. Revolt TV is owned by P. Diddy and his people. Again, when you have a man who's extremely wealthy and a billionaire, it, number one goes to show you that R. Kelly was just broke because if R. Kelly had all the money in the world, he would be out here right now doing up golden showers on anybody that he wants to, number one. Number two, it goes to show you that some people will act in a certain way because money and is on their head. And that is why I believe Jason Lee is coming out with this approach. He doesn't want to displease his boss P. Diddy or get a phone call from him because then he will get dropped from Revolt TV in absolute seconds. I think his comments are absolutely insensitive and what is wrong with a lot of men. We like to victim shame in these examples. And this is exactly what he is doing when Cassie has come out with all this. Just because Cassie has settled does not mean that she is lying. Just because Cassie has settled, it does not mean that she lied about all her allegations and she was doing it for a money grab. It doesn't mean that in any capacity. And now he's going to tweet about how he's been molested and etc. And whilst that may be true, and whilst I do feel sorry for him that he may have gone through that, it doesn't negate anything that he's saying in regards to Cassie. It's very ignorant. Cassie settled because she didn't want to drag this out in court, got the information out publicly, grabbed the 30 mil and called it a day to spend the rest of her life with her family because she's been through a lot. It doesn't mean that Diddy is innocent. It doesn't mean that Diddy didn't do anything because Diddy has enough money to drag this out in court to profess his innocence if he wants to. But for somebody who has eventually decided to give back people's their catalogs, has decided to settle with Cassie within 24 hours. The math is mathing. Do your math, please. The fact that this man wanted this story gone in absolute seconds speaks volumes. And we have men like Jason Lee and other rappers as well speaking out, victim blaming, saying that Cassie is doing it for a money grab, that she's lying about X, Y, Z, she's going to get dragged, how dare she, etc. When you've read everything that this woman has gone through and everything people have been saying, you want to quickly come and victim blame. It's disgusting, but this man is owned by PDD. You're not a man. You're owned by another, you're owned by another man, bro. So <laughs> it's just a shame and it's just embarrassing. And you have a lot of these bloggers online who are also coming out with the same regurgitation, the same conversation where they are victim blaming, constantly blaming Cassie, saying that she's doing the most, she's doing it for money grab. Why didn't she speak out at the time? She's only speaking out now, so grossly insensitive. And that's why men are fucked up. We don't create these emotional spaces. We don't, we, we, we produce and provoke all this masculinity, masculinity, sorry, BS. And then you have men that say stuff like this, which forces other men to be quiet. Because the men who've been touched up by PDD, they're not going to speak up now, seeing what everybody else has been saying, let alone any other girl. It's very difficult. The victim blaming and the lack of nuance, this discourse, I hate this discourse so much. I don't know how anybody can come out here and start cussing out Cassie and have zero energy for Diddy. It doesn't make any sense. Anyways, let me know what your thoughts are when it comes to this. Subscribe to the channel, guys. Click that button for daily and consistent content. Subscribe, and I'll catch you guys soon for another video.